And in tonight's top story at 10 o'clock, healthcare workers are the ones on the front lines for sure of this pandemic. Six News reporter Cole Johnson spoke with a Central Texas nurse who decided to help out in New York City and tells us what she's experienced thus far. Victoria Murillo has been nursing for two years. She works in Colleen at Advent Health Central Texas. She chose this career because she enjoys helping people, taking care of patients the same way she hopes others would take care of her family. It just feels like um, it's where I belong right now, helping, not just helping the patients, but also helping other nurses that are drained as well. Today was her first day on the floor in New York City. Well, today my day really just consisted of helping out the other nurses. Um, there's, I know where I worked, uh, this specific area had a lot of trained patients and um, gastrostomy to patients. Continuing on saying it's definitely more than she'd experience at a normal basis at the hospital she works at. There was actually plenty of nurses there. Um, and it was kind of just like all hands on deck. We help out where they help. If the nursing assistants needed help, we would help them. When it comes to personal protective equipment, she says the hospital is willing to provide the equipment that they need. For instance, if a mask looks soiled or if a face shield is hanging off from the side. I feel like the crisis that we're in right now, there's obviously a shortage, but I do feel like I'm well equipped. Her message to Central Texans, keep washing your hands, taking hand sanitizer over gloves in public, use fabric masks, and social distance. Reporting for 6 News, I'm Cole Johnson. And Victoria says she is aiming to be in New York City for the next four weeks.